Well, wandering around Newlyn this morning, I'm discovering that many people remember the Allen apple, although they no longer give them. The Allen apple would have been given on October the 31st, especially in this little region of Street Knowing here, Foundry Lane, and the young people would be given an apple to go to bed and take sleep with it under their pillow and then the next morning they would have dreamed of a new sweetheart. I used to think it was to make me handsome for a sweetheart but uh, it's very much associated obviously with Halloween and all the things that we celebrate in France they call it Toussaint, Germany is Valpurgisnacht well down here it's Allentide and as I say I've met one or two, there's Mrs Mary Harvey and there's Ari Matthews who well remember their Allen Apple. I remember having an uh, uh, apples when we were children, yes. yes. What we yes, used to I... do with them? Well, as I said, we used to choose an apple as a child. Yes, you'd be bought by the gallery, didn't they? lovely, it? large, rosy yeah. apple that we chose. And as children, we just were allowed to take them to bed and put them under our pillow. Yeah. To dream of a future lover or husband. Did you well, do that, Ari? wasn't so romantic. I think we used to put out under the bed and wait until the next morning. <laughs> to eat them. To eat them, then. No. Yeah. Did they work, do we think? Oh, well, I've no regrets. No, I, I, think they, I think they did a very good job. Yes. yes, I do. Whether or not you remember the Allen apple, seems we're all very sentimental about the old things, but we don't carry it out. Do you know, I didn't give them to my daughter but I intend that my grandchildren are going to have them. Here are Davy, my bird. Here's your Alan Apple.